I'm Ariana Fox and I'm so excited to present this to you. So if you remember the last few videos I made, um, they were basically concerning cats and then tigers and then cats versus tigers. So um, things about cats, things that cats do, and then things about tigers and things that they do and uh, what they're like. So this one is going to be talking about the environment that we made, um, our little craft, and I'm so excited um, to present this and the tiger one to you. But let's start with the cat. So I call it Pet Paradise, a perfect environment for a pampered house cat. So now that you know all about cats and tigers, it's time to view our environment for these furry people. First, let's look at the cat environment my mommy and I made, so whoop, whoop, credit goes to mommy. Um, let's start with the inside of this cat environment, the house. This is the house portion. So right here, we have the scratching post right here that I am modeling with our little cat by the name of Splash, a little demonstration cat. And so she can sharpen her claws and mark her territory because her paws have scent glands on them. Then we have a cat bed because cats gotta sleep, right? So we have a fluffy and comfortable uh, cat bed. So the cat feels right at home because, well, she is home. Um, and then we have two little perches for Splash to lay on and stand on right here and right here. Um, because cats like to be in elevated places. Uh, plus we made the perches near the window, right in here. Uh, so that way, let's make her right on here. So that, um, so yeah, anyway, it's right near the window so Splash can look out the window to the beautiful outside world called Earth. And then we have these dividers right in here. And one doorway leads to her eating area uh, where she can eat right in here. Um, and we have, if, if um, you can also tilt the uh, camera to where it picks up on Treats, which if you'd like, I can take the camera right here to show the treats and cat food, a uh, little treat bag. Um, so we have cat food, some canned cat food right in here, um, a food bowl and a water bowl, and a treat bag. So um, we did that, and then the other doorway leads to her litter area where uh, our little cat goes to the bathroom. And um, so that, that, this is a litter box right in here. That's a litter scoop. And as she's picking up right now, um, that is some cat litter. And we actually purposefully made these two areas to be separate rooms because cats don't like eating and going to the bathroom in the same area. So she can be in her litter box and not have to worry about being um, right next to her food because they don't like that. Um, so we also have balls and toys and play things, like, as you can see right here here, 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 and here. Um, just things for her to play with so she's never bored and always entertained and having fun. Um, and then, I'm so, so, so excited, we are heading outside now. And as you can see right here, there is a, uh, a little, basically there's an opening right in here and a uh, catwalk for the cat to climb up and go outside to what we like to call the catorium, um, which is basically a the cat emporium. Um, so we also made some grassy turf, which is what she's standing on, um, to, for the cat to feel like she's outside, even though she's actually really in a safe, protected outdoor environment guarded by the graded openings, as you can see here. Um, we also have an awesome catwalk for Splash to climb up onto and go onto, so that way she is elevated and she has a perch and um, she can test her balance as well. Um, we also even created, she can jump down, we also even created a little cat house for her to go inside, as you can see right in here, for her to go inside and have some shade, protection, and um, even just, just solitude, honestly, uh, because cats are very, very solitary creatures. All right, and then we also have a, an awesome, and this was created mostly by mommy, uh, but this was like such an amazing addition, is the cat tree right in here, uh, where we, not only does Splash have some awesome elevated perches, uh, cats like those, but also some scratching posts as demonstrated and seen right in here. So the cat can scratch and even scratch right here. So now that we've shown you our cat environment, let's move on to the tiger environment. I am so excited to show this to you, and thanks so much for watching.